in the role I'm doing now, which is Eleanor, first, uh, Eleanor Her Secret Journey, uh, a play uh, uh, with El uh, one person play with Eleanor Roosevelt being the character. But that, that began with a film for, for CBS called Eleanor, First Lady of the World, which uh, was um, chosen after I left the series. And uh, CBS was obligated to one film under my contract. And about the same time, a, a splendid uh, P PR fellow named Dale Olson um, said, you should play Eleanor Roosevelt. And then a disc jockey in the Valley said the same thing. So that got me interested. And uh, this idea uh, for a movie was born. And... I did hours of research in Hyde Park, and then I joined a, a group which was um, determined to get her home back, Val Kill, uh, her home up there in the compound in Hyde Park. It was in private hands at the time, and uh, I was shocked by that. And this group in New York State, uh, headed by the lieutenant governor, um, began a campaign and I helped by doing an, a, um, a, oh, a 10 minute monologue about Eleanor and what her home meant to her, written by Rhoda Lerman, the author of the play I'm now doing. Anyway, we did this. Norman Lear put it on film. They used it, they indeed uh, acquired the property, and now it's part of the tour of the Roosevelt compound in Hyde Park. and administered by the National Park Service. And that film uh, became mine and Rhoda Lerman's testimony on the bill that went through Congress very quickly uh, to make it so. So we're very pleased about that. The basic rule is to be truthful and honest in what you're doing. And there are so many other uh, uh, other uh, ways to uh, discover that truth. But uh, that's what you must get to, the truth of the character and the truth of the play.